Hello everyone. Welcome to the Prep Zone Challenger series. All those who don't know about this Challenger series, you can follow this particular playlist. We have updated our entire YouTube channel and have put in so many conceptual questions into it with everything that you need for the MBA preparation. So explore the channel, watch the videos, and I'm sure you're going to have a great, great learning experience. So I am going to continue this Challenger series which I started last year where I, where I used to pick up one question every day and then we used to solve it. These questions used to be some tricky and some challenger questions. Okay. So today again, I have brought to you one of the questions which no sing, which no student was able to solve until now. So just before we begin, a small, yeah, a very small announcement to everyone. So this is the Hall of Fame and I hope and I believe that I would be able to see most of your names into this poster next year. And uh, these are the results. I can vouch for it that the results have been best in terms of percentage. So because we have our personalized batches, so batch size is small, hence percentage makes more sense for the results. And our last in the final batch, which is batch three is starting soon within a few weeks. If you are yet to register, just call me on the given number and we can discuss about it. And this is the question for today, which no student was able to solve. I think people have taken five attempts, 10 attempts, but they were not able to solve this question. I do not know why, because this looked like a straightforward question. One thing can be key. You might have some issue with the language. So stay tuned, look at the entire solution. And, and at the end of it, I have an important announcement to make for all the cat students. Okay. So yeah, before, uh, like without any further ado, let's move on with the question. The question says, find the number of total fives when one to 240 are converted to base six. Okay. So I have some number in decimal system, one to 240. I have to convert them to base six and count the total number of fives. So I know base six may mujhe convert karna hai. So first thing is, first thing that we should see is ki ye teen digit number hoga hai, char digit number hoga in base six, right? That is the first thing because the number of digits is going to determine the number of fives. So let's see. So as soon as I've seen six, the first thing that I should be able to see is which is the closest number that is a power of six within this range. So yeah, see if one thing that should come to my mind is six cube is nothing but two one six. So I see this is the application of these cubes and squares that you should remember. Now six cube is what six cube will be nothing, but this one triple zero, right? So I know this is one triple zero, which is six cube. So this is still two forty. I have to start from one till two forty, right? So let's break it into two cases, the number from say one to 215, and then we'll talk about number 216 to 240. Why we are doing it? Because one to 215 will be my three digit numbers and 216 to 240 will be my four digit numbers, right? So now let's talk about case number one. So now in the first case, I know I come like this has all the numbers, right? From like, you know, I can have a maximum of how many numbers? 216 numbers, right? But I need 215. So yeah, TK. Anyways, we can exclude zero. So let's say that we are actually considering from zero to 215 rather than one, one to 215. So as to have the entire sample space. So now how many fives can I have in these three digits? Again, it's a very classy problem of PNC. How do I do it? Guys, repeat you don't have to count manually here. Eight bar five aya, two bar five aya, three, three bar five aya. Time like that. It's got direct shortcut. Kya hota hai. You just have to visualize. I have three places for fives to come, right? So I can choose any one value for five to come. Okay. Now, total number of ways. Kitne mere paas. Pe I can have six values, zero to five, because it is in base six. So all the digits have to be less than six, which means all the digits have to be either zero, one, two, three, five. Any message digits, hoga, right? So in total, I can have six digits. So you have a three digit. Ho sakti hai. A tenth digit pe bhi chhe digits are possible and unit digit pe bhi chhe digits are possible. Total itne number possible hai. Right? Mujhe nikalna hai ki isme se yaar kitne number se matlab five kitni baar aara hai. I have to calculate that. So what do I do? I just multiply with probability of five. I know total chhe numbers hai and because maine saare hi numbers cover kiye hai from zero to 216, it has to be symmetric. So probability of having five should be one by six. Why one by six? Because in total, I have six digits, zero to five, which is five ka nikalna. So by symmetry, I can say one by six se mira, at least eight digit. Aa okay, I will just solve this. This is nothing but 36 into 308. 
इफ यू आर नॉट क्लियर विद दिस आई वुड स्ट्रॉन्गली रिकमेंड यू इसको दो डिजिट में करके देखो दो डिजिट में आंसर क्या था टू सी वन इंटू सिक्स इंटू सिक्स इंटू वन बाय सिक्स सो आंसर हैज टू बी ट्वेल्व आप विजुअलाइज कर सकते हो जीरो टू फाइव जीरो टू फाइव टोटल बारह नंबर्स हो सकते हैं राइट सो हंड्रेड एंड एट टाइम्स आई आई हैव यूज फाइव फ्रॉम जीरो टू टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टीन राइट नाउ टू हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन इज वॉट टू हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन इज नथिंग बट वन जीरो 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 एंड वॉट इज टू फोर्टी टू हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन प्लस ट्वेंटी फोर इज टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी एंड ट्वेंटी फोर इज नथिंग बट वन जीरो फोर जीरो राइट ट्वेंटी फोर इज नथिंग बट सिक्स इंटू फोर ट्वेंटी फोर सो आई कैन डायरेक्टली से मुझे अब बस इनमें नंबर ऑफ फाइव निकालने आई नो इस डिजिट में फाइव नहीं है इस डिजिट में भी फाइव नहीं है सो आई सो नाउ माई प्रॉब्लम इज मुझे जीरो जीरो से फोर जीरो इन बेस सिक्स आई हैव टू कैलकुलेट नंबर ऑफ फाइव इट्स वेरी सिंपल क्या हो जाएगा जीरो फाइव राइट वन फाइव टू फाइव एंड थ्री फाइव दीज आर द ओनली फोर नंबर इन बेस सिक्स विच विल हैव अ फाइव इन इट राइट विच मीन्स इन शॉर्ट द आंसर ऑफ सेकेंड पार्ट विल बी फोर सो इन टोटल माई आंसर विल बी हंड्रेड एंड एट प्लस फोर इज इक्वल्स टू हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेल्व अब मुझे ये बताओ गाइस इसमें तुम लोगों ने कहा प्रॉब्लम करी आई नीड टू नो इट सो दैट आई कैन हेल्प यू आई कैन करेक्ट यू आई कैन गिव यू बेटर गाइडेंस इसमें कहा मिस्टेक करी वॉट वॉज द मिस्टेक क्या क्वेश्चन समझ नहीं आया या फिर कुछ सिली मिस्टेक कर दी ठीक है मुझे कमेंट में बताना ऑल्सो गाइज आई वॉज थिंकिंग की आई शुड हैव सम मोर एल आर डी आई सेट सो वी हैव डन दिस बेस्ट एल आर डी आई सेट सीरीज अर्ल डी राइट जहां पर मैंने रोज एक एक सेट सॉल्व किया था सो आई वॉज थिंकिंग कि क्या दोबारा से वी शुड स्टार्ट दीज एल आर डी आई सीरीज मे नॉट बी डेली बट या ऑल्टरनेट डे बेसिस माई बैंड बिल्ड बट डू लेट मी नो इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन अगर मुझे इनफ कमेंट्स आते हैं इफ आई नो कि मोस्ट ऑफ यू वर फाइंडिंग इट यूजफुल देन आई कैन अगेन स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन इट आई कैन स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन सम डी एल आर गुड सेट्स एंड देन आई कैन ट्राई टू अपलोड दैम ऑन द यूट्यूब चैनल ठीक है बट बिफोर फिनिशिंग द वीडियो गाइज काइंडली सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल we are coming up with a lot of innovative things in the coming months and the only motivation for us is if we have decent number of subscribers so yeah that's it i'll see you all at 8 pm today yes i'm coming live where we'll discuss on the six month strategy for cat and i'm going to talk about all the sections and details study plan and at the end we'll also solve some questions theek okay? hai so i'll see you guys and if in case you like this method like the video share it theek okay? hai okay thank you